Namaste students. In this video, we are going to discuss to find the volume of a objects. Here is the given object. They are given the dimensions of the object. The given object is brick. Dimensions they are given at and here. This will be called as the length and this dimension will be called as the breadth and this vertical edge will be called as the height. Since the object is in the shape of a cuboid, so we have to apply the formula of a cuboid to find the volume of this object. So first we will write the dimensions that is length of this given object is 20 centimeter so that I wrote at an here. Next breadth is 10 centimeter this edge is of 10 centimeter so I wrote 10 centimeter as a breadth and next height means either this edge or this edge or even this edge will be called as height of the object. Here they are given height as a 6 cm, so I will write height is equal to 6 cm. Now we will apply the formula of a cuboid. That is volume of a cuboidal brick is equal to length into breadth into height. Length is 20 cm, breadth is 10 cm, height is 6 cm. Now we will find the product of these three dimensions. 20 into 10, 200, 200 into 6, 1200, centimeter into centimeter into centimeter, it will become cubic centimeter. Hence, I will get final answer as 1200 cubic centimeter. Let's take one more problem. Look at the solid figure given here. Find the volume. The measurement are in centimeters. Here is the given solid figure. They are given the measurements of each edges in centimeter. This edge is of 4 centimeter. This edge is of 2 centimeter. This is 3 centimeter. And this is 10 centimeter. And this is 3 centimeter and this edge is of 5 cm. As you can see this solid figure, it is neither in the shape of a cuboid nor in the shape of a cube. To find the volume of this solid figure, I will break this shape into two solid figures by joining these two vertices. After joining these two vertices, I got one more edge at and here. This is also of 4 cm because this is forms the cuboid shape. Now I can find the volume of this first figure by using the formula of cuboid. Same way down part forms the another cuboid. Again by applying the formula of a cuboid I can get the volume of this second solid figure. Once I get the volume of first and second, I will add these two to get the full volume of this given solid figure. So first we will take the upper part. Upper part will look like this. I will join these two vertices. Now you just see this is in the shape of a cuboid. First we have to find the measurement of length, breadth and height. So length means the measurement of this edge. Here they are not given the measurement but upper part they are given it as a 4 cm since this edge will become 4 cm. So I will write this edge as the length. Since length equals to we got 4 cm in first figure. Same way we will calculate the breadth. Breadth means length of this edge. Here they are given it as a 3 cm. 
so I will write breadth of figure 1 is equals to 3 centimeter and next we have to find the height this length will be called as the height height they are given 2 centimeter so I will write height of a figure 1 is equals to 2 centimeter now I will apply the formula to find the volume of this figure 1 volume of figure 1 is equals to length into breadth into height Substitute the values 4 cm into 3 cm into 2 cm 4 into 3 12 12 into 2 24 cm into cm into cm cubic centimeter. Hence we got the volume of figure 1 as 24 cubic centimeter. Now we will find the volume of the second figure. Second figure will look like this. I will join this point. As you can see here, this is also in the shape of a cuboid. To find the volume of this second figure, we will apply the formula of a cuboid. First, we will identify the length. Length, they are given here as a 10 cm. So, that I wrote here. Breadth means this measurement, that is a 3 cm. I wrote 3 cm here. Last, height means this vertical edge that is 5 cm. Now again apply the formula of a cuboid to find the volume of this second figure. So that is length into breadth into height 10 into 3 into 5 cm will get product as 10 into 3 30 30 into 5 150 centimeter into centimeter into centimeter cubic centimeter. Now we got the bottom solid figures volume that is a figure 2's volume as a 150 cubic centimeter. We will consider both the volume figure 1 volume and figure 2 volume to find the complete volume of this given solid figure that is total volume of a solid figure is equals to 24 cubic centimeter plus 50 cubic centimeter. After adding these two, we will get the final answer as 174 cubic centimeter.